for me, I was just what I was saying before, people don't realize how bad their doors are until they have to do something about it. And then they goes, well, I think that's a huge blind spot. Um, especially if people are, you know, have high occupancy, they're like, everything's mm. fine. We're good. <laughs> yeah, until um, one day you're not. <laughs> until one day you're not. Exactly. <laughs> For me, it's uh, it's building damage. Like I see mm. dented stuff, you know, obviously in being in the metal business, I'm, I'm keyed in on that stuff all the time, you know? So when I see, you know, a downspout that's been half ripped off or they didn't put it back on or someone running into the corner of the building and haven't got around to fixing it and stuff like that. So I think the, the, you know, to the cleanliness and the security and the brightness, and it's about making sure that your facility, you know, represents what you want it to be as well. And so when you let little things go, you know, they have a tendency to ball up and, and become bigger things. And, you know, for something that you're looking at that may be like a, you know, several hundred dollar fix, but aesthetically it might make all the difference to someone who walks in and sees a dented panel or a hole in a panel, a hole in a door. They're like, well, I don't want to rent a unit. Is my unit going to have a hole in my door as well? You know, what does that look like for me? So for me, it's about aesthetics and the cleanliness and crispness Maybe. of what things look like. Yeah. Max oh is lost the nest. Yeah. That's so, it. Nothing impacts your security like a nest, a wasp nest <laughs> yeah. coming at you. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Max, so tell me what, what's one of your pet peeves? Honestly, on it's weeds in the gravel, y'all. It kills me. <laughs> we, and you know, yeah. you know, not every facility is going to have nice asphalt. Not every facility needs nice asphalt, right? But like, if you have gravel and you've got weeds all up in that gravel, it kills me because it's like that's not. I mean, I know weeds come and go, but it's not that hard to deal with, and it's not that costly compared to some of the other stuff that we're talking about. It's vinegar. Yeah, we're vinegar. talking about vinegar. Four dollar jug of vinegar, right? Uh, if you oh, don't that want stinks. It. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, but ultimately, to that when I drive up to a facility to hang out with a client or to visit. Uh, it's, I, I weeds in the gravel or weeds where they're not supposed to be really gets me because uh, it's just a sign that, yeah, like Nigel, like you said it, if you're not taking care of this small stuff, what else, where are the weeds that I don't see, right? And and that's kind of like where the, the, the lizard brain kicks in. What about you? Mine is dirty hallways, especially mm -hmm. um, hallways that have just been cleaned with just a push broom. And then all the dirt ends up in the crevices of all the doors. And it's yeah. like, you didn't actually sweep at all. No, you did not clean these floors. Yeah. You just pushed it. And, you know, you actually are pushing it into other units and that's not cool. So that's a no. pet peeve of mine. No, that's so. real.